Here we are. Here we are again. Go ahead and pull the lever. Um, if you want to know the particulars of how I do what I do, take a look at the book titled How to Be uh -oh. a Detective. What? It's real helpful. So, oh, Twitch is just the mystery solving business. thinking. There we go. Sure Great. Check out my okay, we're fine. If anyone cases in there, can fix this problem for me, where the really Nancy scary. Drew game just doesn't Don't have sound, that to my dad, okay? unless it's the first time I've opened it since there. restarting my computer, you do, read I will be file, eternally indebted to you and that also give you twenty dollars. Wow, twenty doll hairs. Yeah. I'm serious. I might even give you more. <laughs> I just, I don't know how to fix the problem. It's a bullshit problem. It's a bullshit problem. It's the thing. It, yeah. Mm. After I'm done with this, at, like after we finish this game, I am going to back up everything on my computer and then do like a hard, like, like wipe it and reset everything. And oh, we, Wow. That yeah. will fix it. Will fix it, but I don't know. Computers are bad, actually. They're very bad. They're bad. They're bad. Oh, Nat is making eyeball emojis. Nat, is this a problem you can solve? Do you want 20 or more doll hairs? Several doll hairs. Um, okay. Let's do it. What were we? We were um, about to make lunch. Oh yeah. Okay. <sighs> do you? Think oh, Biz, those... do you want to help us with lunch? Do you think those coded messages make it sound like we're supposed to find the bone somewhere here? Um. Whoops. Oh, the friend. Um, I don't know. Here we go. Here we go. I took a picture of my microphone. Oh my god, <laughs> okay, let's take one. It's got confused. Okay, let's go. Okay. Uh, a hamburger. A hamburger. <laughs> All right, ready? No. Oh, I guess you gotta have the burger done first. Yeah, I'm making a second burger, which will confuse me, but will also save time. Okay, what goes on this burger? Okay, there's your first one. Yeah, what do you mean? There it was again. Okay. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Hold on. Let me secure that. Oh my okay. god. Okay. Oh. oh, she does not desire to be helpful. Okay, two lettuce. It was just one cheese, though, right? Yes. Okay. One pickle. And then one each of uh, the condiments. Oh, wait. Oh. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> uh, okay. One cheese, two lettuce, one pickle, one pickle, no tomato, one mustard, one ketchup, no onion. You have to say no tomato, no onion, or no, no, something. You cannot just skip over them completely. Okay. <laughs> didn't I didn't know that system was so fragile. I just... I've gotten used to cryptic instructions, so when you say one each, then I'm like, oh, the last two things, one each. That's fair. Okay. I. It's deeply weird to just serve a cheesy on the side of a hamburger. <laughs> Okay, but I would eat a hamburger with a quesadilla on the side. Also, these do not look like hamburgers. They look like turkey burgers or something. Like, they look like hamburgers before they're cooked, uh -oh. but once they're cooked, they look like... Jo Joey? Am I gone? Oh! Hello? Uh. Hello, hello, can you... hello, hello. Hello? 
Twas brillig in the slithy topes did gyre and gimble in the wave. All mimsy were the All mimsy were the mora groves and the mumrats <laughs> outgrave. I'm so with no R and oh the mumrats outgrave with an R. You are a pedant. <laughs> yeah. You said it and not I. <laughs> Okay, on this burger, yeah. two cheese, two pickle, uh. one tomato, no onion, no onion, one met matured and one. <laughs> what was that? Order up. Okay, good. Ah, one idea. That's easy. That's a very sad. That's that's the depression lunch we've all had, which is a single microwaved quesadilla. Oh hell yeah! I want a quesadilla now. That sounds so good. Got it. Two from the top row, one of everything else. Great. God, I love red onion so much. I feel impartial about one onion versus the other. I don't know what it is about red onion that makes me think I like it more. I don't I don't know that it actually tastes that different, but in my head it, it is does. a nice color pop. And for caramelizing, I love red onion. Order up. Yeah. Okay. Two skip. Two skip. One skip. One. Beautiful. I want to know everyone's burger preferences in the chat. Tell me what you put on your burger. Like, if you're making a burger I at think... home, if you're making a burger at home, what do you Didn't we have this conversation? Maybe, but I want to have it again because I have a poor memory in this particular mm. respect. I want to know what you put on your home burger and in what order. The ho home burger. Emma says, Biz would like a hamburger. And Emily says, give Biz a burger. Biz, would you like a burger? Oh, Matt was just making eyeball emojis because we went live. They're not... Familiar. She's not familiar with the mysterious arcana of Nandrew OBS and sound setups. It's not even OBS. Okay. It's it's literally just the game. OBS like is the, the unfortunately the least complicated yeah, element. OBS is fine. Everything else is. It's not even getting Caitlin to hear the sound. It's it's just me hearing the sound. Like it's like even if I did not have all of the other setup. If I was trying to just play the game, the sound would disappear. Okay, you can sit here, but you're not allowed to touch the keys. Okay. Everyone is very pro-pickle. We finished with lunch. What are we doing now? Bone, oh, rope nice. surprise, journal, wolf, raccoon locks at night. Okay, I think we gotta go back to the shack, but I am wondering if we need to Back explore to the, shack. the guest rooms more thoroughly and see if there's a bone in one of them. This okay. Remind me how we get to the shack. Oh, um, I don't know. Let's poke around the needle. We need to make a fucking map. I should have written this down years ago. Is is the the shack is the one that's around back of the lodge? Actually, I'm pretty sure. Uh, that is false. Back towards the lodge. 
Oh, wait, it's false? I think that's false. I don't know if I go right or left here. Oh, that's the needle. Wait, do I go past the needle? No, I can't go past the needle. And I can't get into it. Okay, so then we do go left, which means... Ugh. Right, further. here. Nope. Yeah, but I just want to see... There we go, okay. Wow, Nat is like king of condiments or toppings. Oh, pickled banana peppers. I'm into that. Yeah, pepperoncinis. Go back to Chicken Ridge and risk getting caught in another Fuck. Outback. I don't think Yeah, okay, so it is the one out back. <sighs> I just mm. I'm confused. Did Nancy get in the hole? For me. Thank you very much. I guess. She just fit very nicely right down in there, huh? Emma says no to burgers because she's veggie and doesn't like veggie burgers. Okay. <laughs> you know, my grandpa, I think it's called a Philadelphia burger, would talk about sometimes just making burgers without the burger but all of the condiments. Oh, interesting. <laughs> a pickle yeah. sandwich. Yeah. Do we have any toasty packs right now? I just, here's the thing. I think what's out back is... Much better. The lake? Really cold. Is, uh, wait, the lake is, we scrape? Is, no, wait, wait, no. Is the ice fishing shack and the... Uh, the place that was blown up. The other place that was blown up. Where the farm hands no. live. No, no, no. That's, that's past... That's past the little girl who throws snowballs. That's a different we Yeah, that is out back. N no, that's a different that's a different path. Remember we talked about this last time. You have to go oh, all the way around. Okay. Yeah, past the stairs. Okay. Yes. That's the that's Freddy. No, yeah, no, no, not that way. Right. I'm just confirming. Out, that's back Freddy. Back. Yes. Correct. And then I go right. Because we had to get the snowshoes to do here. this. Okay. 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 That's why we should have made a map. Oh, Nat made some of those when she worked at Burger King. All toppings, no burger. Hmm. Oh, no. Fucking Did again? We... Are you kidding me? Are we gonna get saved by the wolf again? Are we dying? No, we're... What? But... Oh, uh, we just Oh, because we didn't put the snowshoes... Well, oh. and we didn't put the snowshoes on. Are you kidding me? Snowshoes save us from a fucking avalanche? Apparently. Yeah, I yeah. This was, this was like a whole thing last time was that we had to put the snowshoes on. Yeah. Okay. okay I forgot. Francis says dead. Wrong feet stat. Yeah. Emma says feet stat avalanche. Okay, that's an explosion. This is where we keep following the tracks. My last three bites of ice cream are melting. Yeah. Here it is. A little ice cream sundae does Wait. sound inc- Oh shit, Who I don't wants... remember this. Oh, I've got it. 6512. Oh, open. good. It's we didn't need to do it. to move to a little stone hut in the wilderness with me? All I have to do is get something from each what? of the people at the lodge. Uh, is Isis the wolf? Wait, what? What's figure out which of the scents matches the scent on the notebook. Wait. What the fuck is happening? I I I have totally lost the thread on the story of this game. I don't know what to do with this information. I mean, Isis is definitely the wolf. 
Um, that and, did and, not age and, well. Um, hint deputy says, um, <laughs> let's read the journal before we get time locked again. And then we can try and process other information. Okay. Julius uh, McQuaid. Yeah, we read some of this before. Um, Freed the Wolf started being friendly to it when she shouldn't have been. Or when he shouldn't have been. Um, the pup, which I've been calling Isis, now keeps no less than seven feet between us at all times, a distance with which I am happy as well. I've watched her hunt for food, have seen what she can do with her teeth and jaws, yikes, and have no desire to ever encounter either her, to ever encounter either on a person, oh, to ever encounter either, like her teeth or her jaws, on a personal mm -hmm. basis. I have resisted the urge to feed her or to make her in any way dependent on me, but I do talk to her. I can't help myself. I've discovered that talking is a very basic human need. Why Isis listens, I don't know, but she does. Of that, I'm certain. 11-11. Make a wish. Snow has begun to fall, so I've moved into an abandoned storage hut that I found. It's a little too close to what used to be an old hunting lodge for my tastes, but beggars can't be choosers. As winter sets in, and I venture outside less and less, I expect that Isis will soon abandon her vigil and make a full return to the wild. I will miss her strange companionship, but that's how it should be. 1117. When I woke up this morning, I was shocked to discover that Isis had found a way into the shack and was lying not three feet away from me. She woke up the instant I did. We stared at each other, and she put her head down and went back to sleep. Apparently, she trusts me, or maybe wants me to trust her. In any case, this is truly un uncharted territory for me, but the urge to explore it is irresistible. 2 8. Like it or not, Isis has become my pet, or I have become hers. I'm not at all sure which. While she is never underfoot, preparing, preferring to remain at least three feet away from me most of the time, she does permit and occasionally seeks out a friendly pat or two on the head and shoulders. Although, unlike most dogs, she doesn't seem to consider my touch to be any kind of reward. In fact, I sometimes feel that by letting me pet her, she's rewarding me. <laughs> 327. With the coming of spring, I fully expect Isis to take off one day and never return, but so far that hasn't happened. She disappears for hours at a time, no, do no doubt to hunt, but for some reason she always returns. 4-4. Four, four. Last night, a wolf started howling in the distance. Isis sat bolt upright and listened so hard she was shaking, but when the howling ended, after a moment, she lay back down and went back to sleep and I suddenly realized that she's not going to leave. Ever. It was either the wilderness or me, and incredibly, she chose me. Seven. Bro! Isis, oh wow, that's a big gap between 327 and 710. Yeah. Isis is by far the smartest animal I have ever seen. By watching her carefully so and I reinforcing... By saying her name, uh, her God, God damn it, Nancy. <laughs> And reinforcing specific actions with specific words, I can get her to perform those actions on command. For instance, whenever I saw her lie down, I'd say down. And now when I say down, she lies down. Here is a list of the commands I've taught her. Have you taken a picture of this? I'm writing it down. Okay. We have down, forward, jump, stay, bark, paw, left, right, around. Got it. Nine sixteen. I can give Isis not just one command, but many commands chained in a row, and she'll carry them out one by one in order. I start such a chain of commands by saying Isis, and I end the chain by saying go. For instance, if I want her to move forward, then lie down, then turn to her right, then bark, then turn to her left, then turn around and come back, I say, Isis, forward, down, right, bark, left, turn around, go. And she does it. She won't even attempt to follow a command that makes no sense to her. She's truly amazing. 10, 12. 
I set up a maze and had Isis navigate it by giving her a chain of commands, and she did it. She did it several times, in fact, with the maze set up differently each time. Moreover, when she's following commands I've given her, she tends to retrieve any strange objects she may come across in the process. Like today, she came out of the maze holding an old sock, which she promptly dropped to my feet. It was like she was glad I was keeping her busy and she was saying thanks. Oh, wow. So, Another big, big gap. Yeah. Three, two. Spent the winter refining Isis's ability to start to sort objects by scent. If she has an object in her mouth... She'll sniff, then drop the object near another object that has the same scent. She'd make an incredible police dog. Hey! (laughs) Don't turn her into a cop! Fuck you! After all, she could retrieve a clue, then figure out who left it by picking the matching scent out of a lineup of of suspects' belongings. That luck would have had a field day with her. 614 Note to self, never, ever, ever feed Isis, especially by hand. Today a rat got into my pantry in the shack. I managed to grab it by the tail and was in the process of flinging it outside. When Isis appeared out of nowhere, leapt up and snapped the rat right out of my grasp, missing my fingers by millimeters. I simply cannot allow myself to ever forget this one fact. Isis is by nature a wild animal. Oh, Tim is here. Hi, Tim. Hi, Tim. I feel like this, I mean, this is, I don't know a lot about, you know, wild animal rehab and things. I feel like this very much feels like the fantasy of 10-year-old us. Oh, yeah. You know, yes. Uh, of 10-year-old Caitlin who wanted to be a wolf rehabilitationist. Yes. Yes. And wanted, and, and like that we could imagine a wolf like obeying all of these commands very specifically and still being wild um because the wolf chose you joey yeah 1026 a freak snowstorm caught me by surprise yesterday afternoon it was sunny and warm one minute next minute it was clouding up and the temperature was plummeting and the next minute it was snowing so hard i couldn't see a thing All I had on was a light jacket, and after wandering around blindly, getting more and more wet and lost and exhausted, I finally sat down, figuring I was done for. And then all of a sudden, Isis appeared, dragging something with her mouth. It was my heavy coat. So I put it on, sat there till the storm let up, then followed Isis back to the shack. She (laughs) saved my life. I'm sure of it. 1224. I've had a fever and, uh, and a bad cough for about two weeks now, and this morning I felt so awful that I almost couldn't get out of bed. So I'm going to hike out to the road while I still have the strength and hitch a ride to Pineville Hospital. Hopefully they'll give me oh. some antibiotics Hospital. and send me on my way before Isis starts to wonder where I've gone. The possibility that she would think I've abandoned her just breaks my heart. Oh. She's come to mean the world to me and then it trails off. Fuck! You can't... Nancy Games can't be sad. Ah! Fuck. So now we can actually call the hospital. Fuck. <gasps> oh. Isis, stay. I love I love wow. her. Look can at you this can like you wolf? Look at those ears. <gasps> oh my god. Oh! I don't uh I I don't know what to do now though. Give give her the scarf. Yanni's scarf. I shouldn't give Isis that. I should give her the notebook. Oh. The, okay. Wait, which notebook? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh <laughs> what now? <laughs> Oh, she's matching it to the notebook. Looks like it's not Yanni's. Okay, but do I have it? It would be a waste to open this now. Wait, do I have... Uh, oh. No, I can't use that. I just don't think I have anything of anybody else's. Yeah, we might have to go back and get stuff. Yeah. I don't need to put these on now. 
But she didn't re react to Yanni, so we know it's not yeah, Yanni's. It's not Yanni's. Oh, and I took it back. Okay. Okay, we've got to find the bone that fits in here that will open the back door to the tunnels. I right. I don't know where to find that bone, but I think we're done here. Yeah. Even though I want to just hang out with this wolf. The little ears? That's just that journal. That's that same journal. What's in the other journal? The one we gave to Isis? Oh, the crime, the crime the collage. Cr the right. crime journal. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, so we need something from Lou and we need something from Bill. Do you think we need something from Ollie? Or Guadalupe? I think if anything from Guadalupe, it would be that that thing we already have of hers yeah. that we can't give to the wolf. Oh, yeah. God, another one? What do you mean another one? There was just the sound of an explosion. No, that was just the door opening and no there closing. no there was a caption that said sound of explosion oh fuck i missed that Well, I don't know. I don't know how to find an explosion. So I'm just not trying. Just gonna go to the lodge. Yeah. I feel warmer already. Um, Let's call the hospital. Yes. Nancy Drew. I'm trying to locate a man named Julius McQuaid. I think he may have been traded there on Christmas Eve. Oh, yes, Julius McQuaid. I remember him well. Was he a relative here? Was? You mean he's passed away? Uh, that's what I figured, but it's so sad. My sis was abandoned. I wasn't a relative, and I didn't really know him. We had kind of a mutual friend. No, Nancy, just lie. Oh. Actually, he wasn't alone. He was with our mutual friend. Well, that's good to hear. Oh. Yeah. Do you still have his personal effects? When he came in, all he had was clothes on his back. No wallet, nothing. We turned his Crap. clothes over to the authorities along with his remains. Last I heard, they weren't able to locate any perpetrators either. I'm sure by now he's been cremated. Well, Thank you for the information. Sorry, Mrs. Drew, you said you could. Goodbye, dear. We should um, call it here. Uh, I know. What Progress, if I just though. Kept playing, though. No, <laughs> Joey. <laughs> Joey, you got the you've got the end of stream caginess. I just want to finish this damn game. Yeah, Nat confirms there was sound of explosion. Um. Okay, well, here's my proposition. I'm going to set the alarm for 6 o'clock. For dinner. 
Yes. And then when we start, we'll do dinner, and then we'll do the objects kind of thing. What? Mm. Well, because we need to get objects from Lou and Bill too. Yeah, I suspect that'll happen in the morning when we do chores, but we have to do the middle of the night door locks. Oh, so we'll have to do dinner and then maybe go to sleep again? Oops. Oh, no. Oh, fuck! Oh, fuck! I skipped dinner! It seems okay. Can we just do the door locks really quick, please? please. Yeah, yes. Oh, okay. my God, Joey. Okay. Um, Hold on. I have to find the picture. Yeah. I truly didn't mean to. I was trying to. I just clicked <laughs> the wrong. Convenient. <laughs> Fuck. Hold on. I haven't been putting pictures in my Nancy Drew folder. Oh, no. Days. You gotta That's scroll through all your selfies. Um, Gotta be totally honest. It's like 90% cat pics. Oh, yeah. That's fair. Oh, I just took a tail to the face. That's rude. Emily says they can make their own damn salads for once. Yeah. Um, we might need to go look at it in the lobby really oh fast. God, I cannot. Caitlin, you're killing me. I uh, listen. I can't find it. It's not with the other Nancy Drew pictures. Okay, here we are. Oh, I found it! I found it! <sighs> okay. Oh, fuck. Hold on. Oh, fuck. I just lost it. Okay, Caitlin, just take this picture, please. It's right here. Okay. Go. Okay. Okay. So Starting on the left. Oops, that's the restroom. Starting on the left. That's white. white. On the other side, red. Yes. Okay. Next. Red on the left and blue on the right. Yeah. Blue. It's already there, because I already put them all in the right place. Blue. Yeah. And green across the hallway. Uh, it's there. I don't know what... Nothing is happening! What's supposed to happen? Um... The fire necklace will tell you all you need to open up the sly raccoon's hiding place. Just don't wake up any lodgers. Are there any raccoons? Like, the moose was in the moose. Are there any raccoons? Oh, and the eyes! The eyes! In this hallway, in the hallway. Oh my god. Oh. I, I, I saw... There it is. <gasps> There it is! Okay. Done. Check. Fucking thank God. Okay. That's, we did it. Great. Um. Belongings? Steal stuff. Great. Love that. <laughs> For us. Hell yeah. Okay. Thank you, everyone. Uh, for your patience through the restart and for your general joy and delightfulness the rest of the time. I fucking love Nancy Drew and Baby Crew. <laughs> wow. This is 10% the whiskey talking, but 90% me, Joey, talking. Old Clink and Joe. Old Clink and Joe. Uh, speaking uh, of which, we'll be in the Discord after this. Yes, we will be in the Discord Unlike last week when you all fucking abandoned me. Emily and I had to talk about um, wedding plans. Yeah, it's fine. I understand. I just... 
Yeah, Francis was there. It was just Francis and me, and no one else showed up. That's how it be sometimes. <laughs> anyway. Matt says, take his eyes. <laughs> We'll be in the Discord. I'm Joey. You can find me on Twitter at Joey the Prince. You can find us on Twitter at Rude Detectives, and you can find our podcast on Twitter at Shadow Facts Pod. Caitlin, where can people find you? You can find me on Twitter at Shalom Behold. Hell yeah! Wow, thank you all. Good night.